It's a response to BioGuide. Wanted to know about how to put, um, keep the connectors from your snow trekker on when you set it up so that they don't fall off. So this is what's in the snow trekker bag. I figured this is probably the easiest way to show everyone what I do. So inside a bag, what I do is I keep uh, in here, I keep, as you can see, here's the post connectors. Here's a pole. In particular, what we're looking at here today are going to be the two snow trekker connectors, which you can see have no, no pins on them. You can check his thing on, online for it. And some cord. I'll show you how I put them together. Okay, so I have everything set up here for us. Take a look at it. Um, big thing is what I always do is I lay the poles out like this when I'm out there in the winter what you're looking for the ends that are like this that are hollow where the the end will go in I lay them like this so that this end that goes into it's here and that ends there so I can raise them like that that's how I do it so I put the two ends on now how the ends go together the snow trekker ends go in like that on both ends so they go in like this. What I have on this little cord here is if you can take a look at it really clearly, you can see I've got the loop through, through a, a tent guy line can end. On the other end of the cord, I have a loop like this, just a standard loop. So what I do with this end is I take it out, I put the loop through, I put it in, and then this part gets wrapped around like this. We put it on underneath. If you can see, we bring the cord through. That helps hold it on. We pull the cord all the way along the end until I get to the other end here. I bring it along. Now I'm at the other end. I'm able to open up the loop. I do the same thing with this end. Hook it on. Bring it around and on and then I tighten this up this cord now one of the things that he wanted the question was really how do you keep your connector ends on of the snow trekker on and keep them from falling out and getting lost in the snow well right here you can see this end is on and that end is on and if we sit here here they are they're not falling so what we're able to do for me, what I do is I do put this extra piece in the center here. Just helps give it some support. It also doubles as my clothesline. Now when I go to put up the tent, I grab the two parts in the center. I bring one end up. We lock it in. Grab the other end. And in the winter, of course, you don't have to worry about bird baths and trees. And maybe you do. We go down to the other end. And because they're right like this, we're able to lift the other end up and bring it up and the ends are right there one and two and there you go it's all set up and you're ready to put your canvas on hope that helps have fun